Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are diving deep into a long-term review of the MacBook Pro 16 on the M1 Pro chip. I've been using this laptop for almost three years and I'm excited to share my honest experience about this incredible machine. This is so far the best tech investment I made in my life. Seriously, I'm not kidding you. Wanna know why? Watch this video. Let's start with the design and build quality. The MacBook Pro 16 maintains Apple's iconic aluminum unibody design. It's sleek, durable and still looks as premium as it did on day one. After almost three years of daily use, it still looks brand new. One of the standout improvements in this iteration is the reintroduction of essential ports, like three Thunderbolt 4 USB-C ports for high-speed data transfer and versatile connectivity, an HDMI port for direct connection to external displays, an SD card slot reader, which is perfect for photographers and video editors, the MagSafe port bring back the magnetic charging connector, which was sorely missed in previous models. I'm glad I purchased the 16-inch model because it really makes a difference. You have more screen, you can do more things, it's really more comfortable to work on a bigger screen. Without a doubt, Apple's Retina XDR display with True Tone technology is simply stunning. The colors are vivid and the brightness levels are excellent. Whether you're editing photos, watching 4K videos or just browsing, the display has been a joy to use. The ProMotion technology makes web browsing such a pleasant experience. Once you will try the 120Hz Apple ProMotion display, you will never go back to the old style 60Hz displays. Even three years later, Apple is still using the same display in the latest M3 Pro MacBooks Pro, so it's still okay. Guys, before going further, I just want to show you a new accessory for my MacBook from the company called Moft. Moft is a premium Mac and iPhone accessories manufacturer. Recently, they've sent me their new magnetic leather sleeve for my Mac. First of all, the build quality is absolutely incredible. Moft uses a proper vegan leather material that imitates the real feel and leather texture. I have a lot of leather products, so I know how it should feel and trust me, their vegan leather feels like a real deal. This laptop carry sleeve features an invisible stand that adjusts to two different heights, offering ergonomics, comfort, whether you're typing or video conferencing. It's available for both 14 and 16 inch MacBook Pro or similar size devices from other brands. It's available in variety of colors to match your personal style. I've been using this magnetic carry sleeve with my MacBook for several weeks now and I can tell you that I really like multitask objects. So it's a carry sleeve and a laptop stand, two in one. I absolutely love this new carry sleeve and I hope it will protect my MacBook for a long time. Guys, if you're interested in purchasing some Moft products, I will leave a link in the description of this video. Now, let's go back to my review. Let's talk about performance. The M1 Pro chip is a powerhouse, delivering exceptional speed and efficiency. The 10-core CPU handles everything from mundane tasks to intensive workloads like video editing and software developing with ease. The 16-core GPU provides impressive graphics performance. It's particularly noticeable in video rendering, gaming and running demanding software. The MacBook Pro 16 on the M1 Pro chip has been a beast in handling everything I throw at it. Whether it's video editing, software developing, gaming, it handles these tasks with ease, even three years later. Their performance are still top-notch, and the laptop doesn't feel slow even with resource-demanding applications. The thermal management is very good. I never heard the fans kick in even under some heavy load. However, the laptop can get warm, especially when exporting 4K videos in Final Cut, which is okay. As I already said, the M1 Pro chip is very powerful. So powerful, it can handle virtual machine with Windows 11 and still run a PC game, like for example GTA 5. Although for better gaming experience, I would recommend using cloud gaming services such as Boosteroid.com or similar. 
You can of course download any Mac games in the Mac App Store and you can be 100% sure that your M1 Pro MacBook will handle any game with ease. The battery life on the MacBook Pro 16 M1 Pro is nothing but extraordinary. Apple's claims up to 21 hours of video playback are not exaggerated, making it one of the longer-lasting laptops in its class. For everyday use, including web browsing, document editing and streaming, expect upwards of 14 to 16 hours, so a full working day on a single charge. For some heavy tasks, like video editing, it can survive up to 6 hours, which is okay. Even 3 years later, the battery life is still stunning. One of the coolest features of this MacBook is its speakers. It has the best-in-class speakers. Guys, just listen to that. It's incredible. This MacBook will easily be supported by future macOS updates up to 2030 or even longer. It's a safe investment for at least several years. From the latest information we know, it will support Apple intelligence, so it's a good news. Probably, thanks to its machine learning course, it can still handle AI tasks. Numbers are not lying. Let's run some numbers about this computer. I bought this machine for two and a half grand. $2,700 to be exact. I'm using it for 3 years. Consider I will be using it up to 2030, so for 10 years in total. It makes 120 month. $2,700 divided by 120 month equals 22 bucks per month. It's a very good deal. Of course, it's my working machine, so the initial investment has been already paid off, but still, it's a good deal. Consider you will buy this computer for $1,500 and use it for 7 years. $1,500 divided by 7 years equals $18 per month. I just want to give you one advice. Don't save your money and get yourself the 1TB storage option, because the more storage you have, the more time your computer will last you. Thanks for watching this video. If you found it useful, Please like it and subscribe to my YouTube channel for even more tech-oriented content. See you next time.